All right, guess who just stopped by the house today? What's up, man? I'm not. How's everything? I got lucky. He had that nice stroke. Man. I got he lucky. Had that nice stroke. Meta World Peace. Yeah, we're in the building. NBA champion, Los Angeles Lakers, All Star Defensive Player of the Year. <laughs> Here to kick my butt. Meta can keep me from scoring <laughs> three times. Then I'll give five grand to your charity. What is the? Is that okay? If you want to. <laughs> He said if he wanted to, that means I'm a... What's game? Think? Game is three? I get three chances. If I score at one, then I win. If I can't score, I give five grand to your charity. All right, cool. Let's do it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Damn it! <Damn. laughs> <laughs> you were waiting for that. <laughs> Here in my garage, you know what's better? The materialistic things? Basketball. <laughs> basketball <laughs> championships. That's no better. You work a lot with kids, you know, in gangs and stuff like that. You think sports is a good outlet? Because that you said that helped you stay out of trouble, right? I think sports is good. I think meditation is better. So you're playing on the Lakers, Kobe's last year, man. Yeah. I know you and him are good friends. What's that like? I mean, it's cool seeing that him go out like that. He uh, worked a lot hard. I played against Kobe when I was 14 years old. Really? Yeah, when I was 14, uh, and to see him come. What'd you play at, what was that? He was in Providence, ah. a little tournament. How was he back then? He was great. He was, he was, he had 50 that game, I think. Were you guarding him? I was still young, I was, I was in the game a little bit. I got in at the end. Cause he's a little older than you, right? He's older, so I, I got in and they put me on him at the end. Uh, he, he had a lot of points by that time already. But yeah. He ended up with about 50 and then, um, and then he also, to see him come to where he's at now, it's like, wow, you know, he deserves now it. Now he's like an icon. Yeah. Everywhere you go, you said people are just like calling yeah. out his name. People love him. Because you're like defensive player of the year, all defensive team. You, that's like a less flashy thing, right. but still as important. I think defense is like just as sexy. It's not as sexy to, if you're marketing a right. player, but the hardcore basketball fans. Yeah, they know. The reason why they, they, they watch that. basketball, they, they know that defense is, very important. And I tell people that with like entre being an entrepreneur, I'm like, it's the little things that nobody sees right. that ends up making you money. Right. Like the people who are, it, when you're building a business, it's like you have to understand the product, product creation, product management. You have to understand how to raise capital. You have to understand how to be persuasive and build a board of advisors. You have to understand how to market. Now with social media, we're talking about you gotta know that. You gotta know old school marketing. You have to know how to build a team, hire, right, right. fire, HR. And that, all that stuff is like defense because it's behind the scenes. Right, right, right. And everybody wants the flashy stuff, which is to be the next Bill Gates and next Mark Zuckerberg. But I mean, the Lakers won a championship when you came there, helped play defense. Of course, you're a good offensive Absolutely. player too. I was decent. Run on test, moving without the basketball. Big time three point play and also solid deep. Our test, that's a three. Bang! Lakers by six with a minute to play. If you were starting over playing again, what do you wish somebody had told you? I was starting over playing. You're a rookie in the NBA. You know what? I wish somebody would have told me that Long Island City was going to triple <laughs> in real estate. <laughs> there you I go. I lived right in Long Island City, but nobody told me. And they, so nobody told no, you? No, I didn't know. And then, um, I guess more, more, I wish I'd have more skills. Yeah. Like you see how Kobe has like so much skill. Yeah. I always worked on my defense. Yeah. I, I, I never worked on like spin moves or like yeah. jabs. Yeah. Or like, um, or the roll off the post. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Or the drop step with your shoulder. So it's you wish you had skills. trained more skills. Yeah. Yeah, more skills. I, I, I trained defense and then I just got by a heart. So for those of you around the world that don't watch basketball, this is a NBA champion. He plays for the Los Angeles Lakers. I'm sure you've heard of the Lakers. I got Meta starting to Snapchat. So I this want you guys to go and then snap to Meta that you're watching him. You can see Meta is very tall because he has he cannot reach down here. 
<laughs> That's my Snapchat. Watch for his album coming out. It's gonna drop March, March 1st, 1st yeah. on iTunes. iTunes. And it's called Streets the, and Ball. Streets and Ball. Yeah, for all like you it. basketball players, boom. Streets and Ball. I'm gonna be downloading it. We'll be talking about it. People are like, Meta! <laughs> <laughs> we love you guys. Uh, <laughs> Alright, we'll talk soon. All right, Doris, boy, Ron Artest has made the most of his second chance. He's worked so hard, personally and professionally, to overcome his past. And some issues, as he referred to there, hit the huge three. He is not the perfect player. He's not the perfect person. But anybody who knows him well will swear by his loyalty and what a big heart he has.